What's up everyone, Danny Lightning back with another Warbots video. Today we are going to build up a really awesome Heimdall Titan. We're going to do a review on this, some gameplay and all kinds of good stuff. So let's get to it. Now this is a Titan that a lot of people don't really seem to like and I'm not 100% sure why. This guy is actually pretty awesome. I do consider this to be a support role Titan, but you put some lanterns on there, you stand in the back, you fire off some shots, you blind some people, you heal your teammates up if they're close to you. It's really just a good deal. Now, when it comes to modules, I'm going to throw an Onslaught, two Repair Amplifiers, and a Grand Balance on there, and that's giving me the best results. If you don't have the uh, Repair Amplifiers, I would probably go with, you know, maybe two Grand Balance, three Grand Balance, two Onslaughts, I don't know, something along the lines of those. Grand Balance and Onslaughts are awesome. All right, let's go do some gameplay and see this guy in action. All right, so we're going to come in on this beacon. We are going to find some red guys to beat up. We want to get those red guys and turn them into d -d 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 dead guys. All right, so there's one right there. Let's shoot the crap out of that guy up in the air. We're going to give him some blindy blinds to the face. All right, so check that out. Another guy in the air. Let's get him. Let's get him. Let's get him. So, oh, man. One thing cool about the Heimdall, though, is he's got two modes. One of the abilities switches between a healing mode and an attack mode. And the other ability either heals you or fires off a little rocket, depending on which mode you're in. So it gets a little confusing for a lot of people switching the modes. But honestly, the attack mode is where it's at. He's got a small physical shield. He fires the suppression rocket. And he fires a constant weapon when he's in attack mode that has a 600 meter range. So it's like having a fourth weapon and a fifth weapon on this guy so you can see the little weapon just constantly firing 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 i mean this is just a crazy deal i mean it's a really awesome titan i don't know why people don't like this i mean it's not a brawler in my opinion but if you can stand in the back like i'm doing and just take people out from a distance it's great i mean that extra weapon does huge damage it's got the suppression rocket it's just an all-around awesome titan i don't see why anybody wouldn't like this thing honestly it is a beast. Heimdall's a beast. I mean, he's not really what you would call squishy either. I mean, he's kind of hard to take down. He's just all around really good. So, yeah. He is an awesome, awesome Titan. That's my opinion. That's my review. He's awesome. I love him. You just got to learn to play him. Learn when to use which mode. Learn how to switch modes. That's the confusing, most confusing thing is people don't understand one ability button switches the modes the other one activates the ability that's really all there is to it once you get the, get the get your head wrapped around that you'll be like hey i kind of like this thing or at least i would think so so hey if you get a chance to upgrade a heimdall i think it's totally worth it but that's just my opinion i have a lot of good games with this guy i've been playing him a lot i am going to put this video on my titan guide playlist right this is going to go on the Titan guide. I'm also working on a new playlist for a drone guide. So we're going to have all kinds of different things. We're going to be reviewing Titans, weapons, you name it. If you guys like this kind of content, hit that like and subscribe. Ooh, we won. We won. Nice. Nice, nice. All right. So let's go ahead and drop this big old bad boy into another game and beat up these red guys. All right. We're going to head on over this way for a minute. We got a great shot on that guy. I think that was a Minos. Holy crap. Here comes a Rook. All right. Can we get rid of this Rook? I definitely hope so because these things are nasty. Nasty. All right. Come on. Get him. Get him. Shoot that little rocket. Bam. If his shield's broken, that would have hit him and suppressed him to help our teammate out. We got him. We took down the Rook. Good job. Hey, there's another one right next to me. <laughs> I didn't realize Grandpa Dan was running a Heimdall as well. So we got the we got the double trouble over here. Here comes another Rook. All right, hold on, hold on. We got to get these guys. We got to get these guys. And my little weapon's just firing away. I normally stay in attack mode most of the time. I mean, sometimes I do move into the healing mode, but generally I stay in attack mode. So there's a Minos coming over here. And let's go ahead and hit him with our little suppression rocket. Uh, right now, might be a good... Eh, I don't know if I should move into... Oh, holy crap, holy. That was fast. That was fast. Hey, let's go try one more. Okay, so we are we are in a big old mess of... I don't know if those are titans or robots. I can't see... A, I can't see past all the other big fat guys that are over there hanging out, getting in my way, blocking my view. But let's go ahead and shoot this dude over here. Uh-oh. 
this is not good this is not good all right so you're gonna see what this thing can do in a sticky situation we're gonna try and get rid of this luchador here comes another luchador get looched sir bam mr grady white's gonna hit him and oh it, it blew up all right so we had a couple of clips we had the titan doing really well we had the titan pretty much blowing up instantly i mean you get in some hairy situations that's gonna happen you can't win them all but bottom line i think the heindel is actually an awesome titan if you build this guy right and get the right type of weapons on it, I think you can have a lot of fun with this thing. I mean, it's actually really darn good in my opinion. I like it. I like it a lot. But yeah, I mean, if you have a Heimdall, I would say level it up if you got the resources. If it seems like something you would like to play, like just standing back from a distance and fighting from longer range, Heimdall's awesome, guys. Heimdall's awesome. All right, well, don't forget to like and subscribe. If you want to help support the channel, check out the thank you button or the join button down below the video. If you drop down the video's description, you'll see some, link to some links to some awesome gear to get for content creation or YouTube videos. That stuff will really help you power up your channel. We got my Discord server. We got my merch store, my other YouTube channels, and a bunch of other stuff in there that, for some reason, I can't seem to remember right now. So I'm like, uh, uh. But yeah, drop down the video's description. Check that stuff out. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. And we will catch you next time. Thanks so much for watching. Lighting out. See ya.